to the Kerrang podcast. We're backstage at Sonosphere Day Two with two of the hell. How are you both? Shit. Oh, yeah, it's been terrible. Yeah. I, I thought it was going to be like a dance festival or something. We turn up and there's all these fucking greebos and waving sticks and shit around and poi and all that fucking bollocks. Yeah. It's, there's a few people turn up for us though. So. <laughs> we were that we were by far and away the best band that played. Yeah. So yeah. We're the band with the most props, I hear. Yeah. Well, you know. We mad got props. Mad props. Yeah. Do you see what I've done there? I've essentially said mad props because we use lots of props yeah. when we play the festival. So that's that For joke. For anyone who, were, who wasn't here, what, what did you do? What props did you bring? What did you dress up as? We dressed up as ourselves. Um, our, uh, our, our, our singer and friend, nice guy, dressed up as a seven-foot penis. And we brought some three-foot penises. So there was some different sized penises yeah. going on. We had some <laughs> hammers, 70. Uh, 10 inflatable AK-47s and um, us sort of jumping around being dickheads. Yeah. yeah. But we, uh, we were very careful with our selection of penises because you don't want to spread yourself thin. No. Do you know what I mean? Don't put all your eggs in one basket, right? So we got some large penises for... Don't want to over-dick them. Yeah, do you know what I mean? You don't want to... T- too much dick's bad news. So yeah, we got some sort of... We got a massive giant penis, which uh, one of our singers was in, and then some sort of medium penises for, you know, new... Penis fans, just to sort of wean them in. Yeah. Do you know what so I mean? Entry, Where do you go from here, dicks. though? Where do we go from here? Yeah. Well, just bigger dicks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're bigger, gonna, bigger We're going to fly into the arena. Well, obviously, we're going to be playing arenas next year. We're yeah. going to fly into an arena with a blimp that is just a massive dick. <laughs> filled with hot air. Here, we have a skeleton cup filled with questions of doom. And if anyone was Ooh. fit to answer them, it is you guys. You reckon? Questions Dip in. Maybe one of them? Yeah. Right. What's in the cup? Take it carefully. I will. Shall I read it, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Show us your best hair, Mosh. I'm going to level with you. I, I'm probably... <laughs> I'm... Right. We didn't pick I'll quite as good Don't miss. On to you. <laughs> that is rubbish. You're trying. <laughs> Building momentum. <laughs> Just a bit of a <laughs> bonus info for yeah. the super fans. That's actually um, Nails' his natural hair colour. He was born like that. He was, a set, he was actually going to be called Red Mist when he was born, but yeah. I was like, mate, I'm Black Mist. You know, I've I, yeah, I got black hair, you've got red hair, I'm Black Mist, you're not Red Mist. More like brown fog, mate. Yeah. Right, <laughs> this is a good question. Which song would you replace on the Metallica set list? Fucking all of them. With... Megadeth songs, Pantera songs, anyone else, man. Fuck Metallica. Wow. Straight talking. It's, uh, there's actually a bit of a story behind that. We don't hate Metallica per se, but when, uh, when Nails was a young child, he was actually dropped on his head and it was onto the Black Album. So ever since, he's kind of blamed those guys for his awful taste in music. Actually, that's probably exactly what's responsible for our terrible, terrible, terrible metal music. Name your favourite pop band. Um, yeah, it's impossible. There's so many. You've got another level. Uh, Mystique. Mystique. Oh, strong choice. Mystique. Oh. ALC. You've got uh, Enya on the gentler side of things. Uh, Lighthouse Family. <laughs> Lighthouse Family. Finley Quay, although he's a person, so it doesn't really count. Uh, um, I, I want to say... Um, Boys. Who, Boys. Yeah, someone the, tried to ban them. In the there. Fat Les. Did Vindaloo. He's my personal favourite. He's not yeah. a band because he's just a bloke, but if he was a band, he'd be my favourite pop band. Perfect. Got us through a lot of hard times, Fat Les, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's music for the soul, really. Yeah. I mean, some people, you know, Nick Cave, me, Fat Les. Perfect. Well, on that note, thank you for talking to us. Have a good day. Thank you. I hope your day is absolutely rubbish and it rains yeah. just on you. Thanks. Okay. Bye. Bye.